Just days after Prime Minister Dr. Timothy Harris revoked the ministerial appointments of six of his former cabinet colleagues, the former Deputy Prime Minister Sean Richards said Dr. Harris lacks the moral authority to lead the Federation. Speaking to reporters at the RLP International Airport, following an engagement he had in the United States, Richard described the Prime Minister's leadership as illegitimate. Uh, Dr. Harris no longer has the moral authority to lead the Federation of St. Kitts and Nevis. Six of us would have written to the Governor General indicating that we no longer support him. So as far as I'm concerned, his leadership at this particular point in time is illegitimate. He now only has two other elected members supporting him. And so it means uh, that out of an 11 elected members of parliament, uh, that he only enjoys the support of three of uh, the 11. And uh, that certainly sends a wrong message in terms of democracy. If a prime minister is elected as prime minister or appointed as prime minister, uh, based on having the support of a majority of the elected parliamentarians, and he now has less than two-thirds of those persons supporting him, it means that the people of St. Kitts and Nevis, in effect, no longer supports him as the Prime Minister because it is the people of St. Kitts and Nevis who would have elected those other persons who have stated quite categorically that they no longer support him. The breakdown of the Team Unity Coalition after PAM and CCM withdrew their support for the PLP Prime Minister forces the electorate back into the polls just two years after the 2020 general elections. Glenn Bart reporting for SKN Newsline.